Hey guys, welcome back to Neva's Bachara. I am back after a very long time with a, a cookery video on a tacos and matia chaat. So, जब चाट बनने वाली हो, then there's no waiting. So let's quickly begin the video. So let's quickly go through the ingredients. So first, I have the boiled and chopped potato, chopped onions, chopped tomato, and here we have boiled sweet corn. We have sel, and here we have all the you know uh, chaat things like chutneys. This is the curd. We have green chutney. We have the tamarind or dates meaty chutney. This is the pomegranate. Uh, we have raw mango, cut raw mango. To give it a bit sour taste, here we have ketchup. This is for plating. and here we have mayo and some co coriander for garnish and let's come to this tray so here i'm going to use cheese dip for a bit ser serving purpose now we have all the masalas here so salt obviously for every dish we need salt then we have our chaat masala and at the last we have jeera masala here is our main thing for tacos of course we need this now this is not tacos in uh it's mathia chaat because this papad is not normal papad it's made up of mathia it's known as mathia and mathia is made up of uh, moth bean or you can say uh, moth bean and orad dal's flour which is known as moth bean is known as matki so this is very very healthy and so i have made your two dish of tacos i fried this here i have some cute little co uh, cone shaped you know cones and it's also made with mathia mathia papad and then it's fried with a you know chimta i have given it a shape and yeah here we have the cute little capsicum for the decoration purpose so how to make this i'll quickly explain here you have to take in capsicum then with the help of a knife you can make some zigzag lines in the capsicum and then twist and turn it and remove the seeds from between and your capsicum decoration flower will be ready so let's quickly begin to make the start i cannot wait anymore so let's begin with some boiled cut potatoes okay now i'm going to add some sweet corn in it add some tomatoes now i'll add some onion now i'm going to add a bit chopped raw mango and now let's mix it well okay now it's the time for all the masalas salt as per taste add some chaat masala to make the chaat chatpati so let's go. now i'm going to add a bit jeera masala obviously the jeera masala is made by you know roasting the jeera and then grinding it in the mixture okay so all the masalas are done and now let's do a final mix mix it well so that it is so we have used the potato so that all the veggies and all the masalas you know get binded up so now our dry masala is ready so now let's keep this aside and do the plating otherwise if we put it directly into the taco or the matia then that will become soggy so first we'll do the plating and then let's serve. so let's begin with the plating here i have some tomato ketchup and now i'm going to put dots at equal distances Now we'll have a toothpick, and I'll join the dots like this. Okay, it's looking super. And okay, so now we'll have our cute little capsicums here. And these in all uh, these, I'm gonna fill some dips. Like I'm in this one, I'll fill mayonnaise and. In this one, I'm going to fill tomato ketchup. So these are the dips of tacos. You can dip it in and eat with it. So let's fill it like this. So now in the other capsicum, I'll put some tomato ketchup. It's really satisfying. Okay. So our both dips are ready, and now we are gonna fill the mixture in the tacos and properly decorate it and place it. So here is I have uh, got a mug, and inside that I'm gonna put two cones like this. So firstly make it and then put. So here we have the filling. We will fill the filling into the cones, and now we will put garnish it with some curd on the top. 
เป็นไหมครับใช่มีที่จัดนี้เอาไปแล้ว The green j a c k e and the music is the same. And now I'll garnish it with pomegranate also and some c o r i a n So this pretty looking cone is ready. So I have made both the cones and it's looking very very pretty. Can you see the dish? Now let's make the tacos, my dear chat. For like that, let's take one T-shaped my dear chat top part. And I'm gonna put the filling. This dish is super duper easy, and it's easy to make. Also, it's very very tasty. So here I have filled the filling in both of the tacos, and now we garnish. It. So I take one and put the corn like this. Now I'm gonna put some coriander chutney. Now I'll put the meaty chutney. It looks great. And now we we'll garnish it with some s e f some pomegranates, and raw mangoes. And you can see the beautiful looking chart is ready. So now I'm going to do the same with the second one. Also. So I fill both of the tacos like this. And now, get special. I'm gonna just put a bit of cheese d e b a c h e e s p r e a d on the tacos. Oh my god, it's dripping! So our tacos, all my dear, are just totally ready, and it looks super. Now it's taste test time. So I have everything in my plate. So let's see. First, I'll test the corn. Mmm. So it tasted very, very awesome and yummy. I I can't stop eating this. Do try this recipe at your home and comment me down below how was it. And if you make non-fire cooking at your home, then like this video. Also share it with all of your friends. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. Also press the bell icon so that whenever I upload my new video, you get the notification first. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.